What's up everybody, welcome back to my channel. And today we're going to be opening up a 2020 Panini Prism Blaster Box. So guys, this is a new product that Panini just released not that long ago, maybe a couple weeks ago. So guys, we're kind of late on the release date on that. But guys, I'm really excited about this. We're coming off a video of opening up a 2020 Panini Diamond Kings Blaster Box. And in that box, if you guys haven't seen the video, we pulled an awesome relic card. It was a quad relic of Robinson Cano. So, really excited about that, and I'm really excited about this, so hopefully we can get something really cool out of this. So, in this blaster box, we're going to get 32 cards in total, so not a whole bunch of cards. Six packs in this box, four cards in each pack, plus this one bonus pack of eight cards, and we're going to be on the hunt for finding two silver prism cards in here. So, guys, I'm really excited about this. Let's get right into this. All right. Here we go. Let's get this plastic wrapping off. Yeah. Really excited about this. I remember when I opened up a 2019 uh, blaster box of Panini Prism. This is before I created a YouTube channel. I got a autograph, like sticker autograph of I forgot. Jeez, I forgot his name. Yeah, I don't remember his name. Um, but it was my first ever blaster box. This, and I got an autograph out of it. So right, let's see if we can successfully open up these packs. Okay, a little weird way of me opening up this pack. All right, here we go. Let's see who we get. Keston Hira. Look at this one. This one's a little weird. What is that? What is that? Okay. Cool little designer here. I was looking at his pants. Really weird. Okay. All right. So Keston Hira. Brewers. Um, Marcus Stroman. Get this green parallel card of Charlie Blackman. Also got a nice rainbow refractor to it. Let's see if it's numbered. No, it's not. All right. And then... Fourth and final card in this pack is Max Munchie. So, there's a thing going on where, you know, people really don't like Panini at all because they don't have the rights to having the players, uh, I mean, the team's logos and stuff like that. Got it open. Alright, how to use my teeth there. Uh, so, some people really don't like that. And um, to me, to, to be honest, our first rookie card here, I really don't care, um, even if they don't have their team logo on there. It's not really much of a big problem. Tyrone Taylor, rookie card. And then Edwin Rios. This dude's been raking right now um, during the inter-squad games for the Dodgers. I think he had a home run off Blake Trinan a couple days ago. He was getting hit in 19 compared to 18 when his ERA was below one. Edwin Rios. Wow. Absolutely crushing that one. I guess the batter's eye, not a problem for Edwin Rios right there, Jerry. Okay, yeah. But yes, again, I really don't care. It was just pretty cool. It's like, ooh, Brewster Gratterall. Dude's on the Dodgers right now. He should be should be in, like, blue. Must. Oh, yeah, okay. It's weird. I was looking at this one right here. You got Edwin Rios, and that one looking like it's in gray. It would have looked better if it was in blue. Uh, yeah, but they got his uh, team right there. Top of the class, Michael Togla. Then look at this one, Drew Waters, now on deck. I like these little insert designs right here. Really cool. So, Panini Prism is like Topps Chrome. But I think basically most of Panini stuff is mostly in Prism. Like in a uh, very shiny chrome finish. There we go. I have to open it this way. Very disappointing. Ooh, I see a mic trout in the back. That must be a cool, maybe it's going to be like a cool insert design. David Fletcher, Bo Bichette rookie card. That's a nice one. Luis Robert, look at this one. Look at this one. It's definitely his rookie card because uh, his rookie card is in 2020. So there's no rookie card logo on here. But still, really cool. Look at that. Now on deck, Luis Robert. It would have been really cool if they had his rookie card logo right there. But that's still really cool. And then right here, yes, it was going to be an insert design of Mar uh, Mike Trout. Stargazing, really cool. Really cool. All right. Back. All right. As again, you never know what you're going to get out of a blaster box. You can go ahead and get a really cool autograph from a blaster box. No guarantee. Oh, this one's got a, like a big scratch right down the middle. That is unfortunate. You see that? You see that? Look at that scratch right there. There's two scratch. There's two like lines right there. That is really unfortunate. It's a lot, of Panini. All right, next one. Max Freed. Nice design right here. Um, got a cool looking rainbow refractor, so that's really cool. And then a final one here is Carlos Santana. 
Really cool. That's so bad. That is so bad. Come on, Panini. Help me out here. Alright. I'm opening this pack horribly, too. Alright, Clayton Kershaw. It's got some little particles on here, too. Clayton Kershaw. Anthony Rendon. Definitely. Yep. Los Angeles Angels right there. Might get mixed up. No, it's not the Washington Nationals. J.D. Martinez. Let's say, say Lumber Inc. Yep, that's pretty cool. I like the two bats there right there in this design. That's really cool. And then Carlos Correa. Alright, so that does it for the regular base packs. We got no hit out of that. But we have this one bonus pack right here. So hopefully we can get a hit out of this. And hopefully I can open this one up successfully. Oh, would you look at that? I opened up a pack. Look at that from Panini. Wow. Alright. Didn't have to use my teeth that time. David Fletcher. Okay, so these are all going to be... Oh, we got some really cool ones back here. So first half is going to be purple. Parallel. So David Fletcher. Bo Bichette. That's a nice one. It's got a little cool looking rainbow to it. Uh, upside down. Lance Lynn. We got Mike Soroka. Dude's going to be a stud. All right, here we go. Look at these ones right here. Michael Brantley. You got Roman Laureano. That dude's got a cannon of an arm. And then final two cards. You might have seen the last card. J.D. Davis, and then Fernando Tatis. So, got a couple of cool big names out of here. These are all the cards right here. I should have separated them, but a lot of cool cards. So, this should be 32 in total. Um, so, guys, um, as I said, I really don't care if Panini doesn't have the rights to having team logos. That's just in my opinion. Some people don't like that at all. Some people do. But, guys, if you guys like the Panini product and want to see more videos like this, let me know down below in the comments, guys. You know I always read my comments, and I'm always responding to you guys. You guys are absolutely awesome. So, guys, let me know down below if you want to see another Panini uh, product opening. Recommend any type of Panini boxes that I should go ahead and open. And, guys, if you guys like this video, hit the, uh, hit the like button. I was about to say hit the subscribe button. If you want to see more videos like this, hit the subscribe button. Turn on the notification button to get notified whenever I drop a video. And, guys, I hope you have a great rest of your day, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Thank you.